MD Supplement Superstore, number one. Sean Ray here in Las Vegas at the Athlete Check-In here at the NBC Suites. I'm joined by Dan Newmar. Dan, give us a little bit of background about you. Uh, right now, I'm, um, it's the first time I've actually ever done USA's. So uh, last year, 2012, I competed Junior USA's. Uh, was successful at that point, won the overall. Um, was going to compete last year, but my, my wife and myself, we moved to Texas. I had a uh, possibility to uh, work on my doctorate in, um, at TWU up in, in Texas. So we moved, had to push off the competing for a while. My goal for my off season was essentially um, I wanted to keep things kind of tight. I didn't, I didn't really want to blow things up to be a 300-pound, uh, fluffy, uh, out-of-control kind of look. So I actually kind of did cardio all my whole off season and kept it up and kept actually my, on my diet. So I really didn't change too much up. As I kept on training all through my off season, but I kept my weight kind of static. It didn't go up or down. Um, I'm actually coming weighing this year less than what I weighed last year. Uh, my coach John White in the past liked to push my weight and try to get me to, you know, kind of stand with the, the big boys as far because I'm not, I'm not the biggest on stage. Um, I'm around the 240, 250 area is where I look my best. Uh, 270, that stuff, I, I, it's just too much for me. I, I don't look good at that point. So I'm not going by numbers this year. I went by look. And so I wanted to bring myself and kind of go with my strong points. Uh, they got big guys like Dusty and Blair. These guys are some big dudes. And so I'm not going to outmuscle them. Um, so I kind of went with, you know, the Sean Ray look. I tried to not the same look, but uh, trying to go for a, more of a prettier shape and uh, aesthetic look because that's kind of my goal and I think that's what bodybuilding is but that's kind of what I want to go for with my physique anyways. Right. Well at least you're training with a goal in mind that you're happy and comfortable with but that being said you're a long ways from the Junior USA's. This is the USA Championships. They've got a lot of formidable competitors on the stage. Are you going to be aware of those guys when you're up there being compared with them or is this just something you're trying to do for yourself and be happy with what you're bringing? No I know these they're, they're, I mean these guys are quality. These are some of the best guys in the nation right now that do the and I, and I consider actually the USA is probably one of the premier shows. Nationals is good but USA is you get a lot of good guys and I know I know that getting in next to these guys is the only way you're going to do well and these are some good guys and, I, and I'm it's an honor to step next to them and compete with them some good people and I mean great physiques these, I mean a lot of these guys have been doing it for uh, at the national level for a couple years now and been very successful trying to get that pro card and the only way, you know, to get noticed is to stand next to them, see how it looks. you got to compare. Well, you've been making the rounds. Now you're living out in Texas where they've grown big. Um, how is training for you out in that state? Oh, I love Metroflex Plano. They've uh, kind of allowed me and my wife and my, kind of, as a family there. I see Steve every once in a while. And there's a lot of big boys, a lot of... Um, uh, weights and a lot of uh, a lot of food too. I like Texas food, um, but it's a good place, man. They're they're very pro bodybuilding, pro lifting, and it's a, it's a great environment. I, I really do appreciate that. And being around people, you know, again, it, it, it's good to be around good competitors because then if you're around everyone, you can be around nobodies and think you're amazing. But when you're around the good ones, then you kind of get an idea what a reference point is. Yeah. Well, in 24 short hours, you're going to be surrounded by a plethora. Hear that plethora of good bodybuilders, and you'll uh, hopefully join the the ranks of a Steve Kuklo up there who won the U.S. USA's overall title, but for right now, we've got a little bit of work to do still, work on the color, just checking in and getting settled here in Las Vegas. Right now, we're at NBC Suites. We're going to check out Dan in 24 short hours at Artemis Hall in the prejudging of the Men's USA Championships 2013. For Dan, I'm Sean Ray, MusculDevelopment.com. Uh, yeah. MD Supplement Superstore, uh, number one.